Last week, we did a rule that did thematic representations, in this case, zoning. But this week, we want to tackle a rule that actually does kind of more powerful representations of zoning, actually does volumetric zoning representations. So here we have the same set of parcels. So we're going to select the parcel. This is a, a commercial parcel. It's rendered by the old rule. We'll drop a rule onto it. It's got a different attribute uh, called mixed use commercial, and that dictates the shape and form of this volume that's generated on the parcel. So there's a whole variety of uh, different zoning types that this supports, but of course you could go in and, and customize it by changing the parameters. So I can knock its height down. Maybe I want to have a larger setback from the street edge, a larger setback from from other edges. Maybe I want to constrain the top of it uh, at an angle from a certain height, right? These are all kind of typical constraints that people put on zoning. And then I could do additional customization. I could change its transparency, or I could give it a custom color, right? So this allows me to kind of create a, a good representation of the maximum build that could be built on this parcel. So let's go ahead and select all these parcels. We'll drop the rule on all of them and we get that volumetric representation right of this block. So two commercial buildings at each corner with some shared commercial along the edges, some residential and some live-in uh, usages inside, green space and parking. So download the rule, give it a try and I uh, hope you enjoy it.